Welcome to Free Practice 3 of the F1 2018 Career Mode. And it's raining. Good grief. If it was raining before qualifying, or raining during qualifying, we would have had a free tire choice. I was supposed to use the two pink hyper soft tires. Not if it's freaking raining, it's not going to be the case. Just struggling for grip. One one two. That's actually my slow. That's actually a lot slower than yesterday. Weather report. this was raining and the track would be dry we would have a free tire choice these times are going to be a little bit slower than yesterday a lot darker than normal of course we had some sunshine yesterday for free practice one At least qualifying will be dry later tonight, so so the track will change. Will would um track the track would change so far, and I go P two. what my second lap will do or will be of course we're gonna have a new uh, boost for Russia A lot of freaking understeer. Just trying to turn gently, and the car wants to understeer like fucking shit. I don't know why. It wants to understeer. Alright. Just. Trying to understeer like shit. Of course, won this race uh, in the F1 2017 curve mode. Looking to go back to back here at Singapore, the Marina Bay Street Circuit. As you can see, the city off to the right. Seb puts a 159.126. That is good enough for P1, but for the and the question is going to be, for how long? So I had to get out of the throttle. Two minute flat.
I'm trying to be a little bit There's how you gain more time and then some We're not going to use our hyper soft tires. Seven one fifty nine flat. I'm just about two seconds slower. Than I'm almost a second slower than Seb. And now I'm nine tenths of a second slower than Seb. That's never f interest never fun to be slower. But at least I have these hyper soft tires all ready to go. These four right here. In case I don't have to use these two. And how long will this rain last so I can run my dry tires? I'd like to run my, dr rain t my dry tires, but it looks like that's not going to be an option. We might have a wet session. Hmm. Yep. It's going to be a wet final session. But at least qualifying will be dry. Qualifying. The race may be a little wet. Of course, unlike uh, what happened to me in Monza, I might try to jump in the pits when it starts to rain. So... Just remember these tire these times will be a lot quicker getting ready to go into tonight's qualifying session here from Marina Bay. I'm on mix too, so it's like normal mix. I would love to make up some points on Ferrari if we're going to have a shot at the constructors this here in this career mode. As I did it again with the understeer. step out I mean I turned gently but the back of the car just really wanted to get squirrely on me I mean it's not raining as hard as we think it's gonna be but I mean it's just little light spits of rain so Understandable why we need to take a set of intermediates. But we'll, I'm going to lose my two hypersofts. But at least I have two of them. 
I got some ready for qualifying in the race. But if the rain makes it interesting, I might probably run like... I probably, what I might do is go back to dries, but then use that uh, other dry tire. So I might do, I might do hyper, hyper, intermediate, and then I might go ultra soft to the end. Because I can't do 19 laps straight on a set of hypers. But the good news is at least the hyper soft tire will be with us for the next race in Russia. Hopefully the weather in Russia will be a little bit better. If it rains in qualifying but dry in the race, we're going to get a free tire choice. Because it's 53 laps. If I saw somebody leaving some debris over in that left, that left hander. Lap traffic is really going to be important to navigate here at Singapore. You know, like I said, the weather may be hot and unpredictable, but we're probably going to see an unpredictable race here tomorrow. You know, it'll be dry, then a little wet, then dry, because the rest of the race will be dry from here on out. So a lot of unknowns what to expect. Plus, can I chase Ferrari down in the constructors? I'm already fighting with the car because the car is getting a little bit squirrely. Hate fighting the car where it's a little bit squirrely. But I'm already up Lance Strolls' rear end. Remember, if I, I don't want to take out anybody in final practice who really need to get their cars good and ready to go for qualifying here tonight. It's like, I like I said, the race tomorrow is going to be really a nip and tuck. think I'm gonna go faster and in the rain in the dry I look superior but in the wet I look like I'm just struggling for grip Yeah. 
is a two minute zero point zero. So this is getting interesting. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right, let's look at the times here. Seb, Ricardo, Reichen, and myself, Hamilton. Everybody is on that green intermediate tire. Hartley is also. Ha yep. So say bye bye to the to the two hypersofts I was going to use for this session. Uh, well, I'll probably use them for uh, Russia. Russia, by the way, is the next race. Because after that, we'll be. I think it's in two weeks. I gotta check. I know it's gonna be on a back to back with Japan. So I know Japan and Russia would be back to back, and then the United States GP in two weeks. My home race in two weeks. Wow. Sorry, I was drinking some pop. So realizing that my home race is about after after the next two races, which is Russia, Japan. Yeah, three races from now we'll have my home Grand Prix. That's nuts. Plus it's a back-to-back -back with um, Mexico. <clears throat> and then I because I can't believe this career mode's almost over Singapore we're at this weekend two weeks we're in Russia then we'll go to Japan then another two weeks until we go to my home race in the States then Mexico then Brazil yeah this career mode's almost over holy shit it's been a long journey I can't tell where the journey will end. I'm not gonna sing the rest of that song because I'm gonna get fucking copyrighted. So sorry. But the track is gonna change a lot. Can't believe I'm ahead of Hamilton. The only issue I'm ha gonna have is the track being green after all this light rain, you know, it might have washed all the rubber off the track. Should I be a bit, ag bit aggressive going into the qualifying later today? You bet I will. And, of course, the speed traps, we've gone a lot slower. So, yeah. Here on this early Saturday evening here in Singapore. Those of you back in the back in the States, I believe it's Saturday afternoon. It's like three o'clock or I don't know what time. But by the time you're watching this premiere, you, you should probably already know the answer to that one. Damn, I am 90, 90 mil So I got a green in sector one, aka my personal bus in sector one.
The problem is with this car and the track, I'm just not good in the wet. I'm like a tenth down. I'm like setting personal, I'm setting like personal bests in sectors one and two. So I'm only like a tenth slower than. But I know qualifying will be a lot faster with the East, with the t with dry than we are in the wet. And I go up to P2. That was a good lap finally got in the 58 so I went a lot quicker so I set personal best in sectors 1, 2, and 3 I just can't beat Seb's uh, impressive lap time which let's be honest Seb really just set a good lap, t lap time so I can't be too angry with him can't be angry if I end up not being the fastest but at least I have a car that's capable of winning probably the pole later tonight here in Singapore. I think it's like morning. Yeah, it's like... Actually, it is morning as of this premiere, but... Yeah. Remember, Russia in a couple of weeks, uh, it will be uh, like, of course, Asia races are 10 p.m. Eastern for free practice one, 1 or 2.30, 1 or 1.30 a.m. Eastern for free practice two, so at least you get to see free practice two, as I said, the best in sector two, but I lost a little bit of time going... So I went faster than seven sector two. Problem is I'm just losing time in sector three. That's the problem. I just can't even get a good sector three going. Nope, and I lost it all in that sector. Shit. Because I'm just squealing the damn tires. And the hypers, we would just be grippier and grippier. Gonna make at least one more run on these tires, and I think we'll be done. Excuse me. And here's some fresh intermediate tires. 58.7. I just cannot beat Seb's lap time. Seb put up a very good lap for me to... For me to struggle with. I try to stay off the curb. Ah, shit, I ran oh, too. It's about to hit the fucking wall. Speaking of Seb, there he is. Remember, I need to make. I need to start making some points up. Check him, and I need to start making some point. Get, start getting gaining some points on Ferrari if we're gonna have any shot at winning the constructors. As I just slapped the freaking wall with the right front tire. Surprisingly, that that didn't become a puncture. Thankfully, it wasn't.
and then Seb just ran into me. Oh, there goes Seb! Seb just crashed in front of me. Looked like he broke something. What? Hold on, dear. I'm driving. Wow, Seb just lost it. Now I got a broken wing. That means Seb's out of practice. He could be out of qualifying. Yeah, I got a broken front wing. I got problems. Hang on, I'll be right back. <laughs> 